hello everyone in this video we are going to talk about mal presentations mal presentation means any other presentation than vertex okay it can be a face presentation it can be bro presentation it can be bridge presentation also so let's start with the face presentation uh, in normal consequences in normal cases the head of the baby just get flexed while increasing contraction of the uterus head is getting flexed and that's why the flexion happens and that's why the position the presentation is of what vertex position so whenever the head is not able to flex what happens instead it becomes extended fully extended like seen in this picture the head is fully extended in that case is face presentation happens now what is the mechanism of labor in this kind of mal presentations you see here the picture in this picture the mentum means the chin is anterior that's called mento anterior and in this picture the chin is in the posterior side so it is called mento posterior definitely in case of face presentation the denominator we use is what a chin mentum so mento anterior position is very very common 60 to 80 percent and in that case the engaging diameter becomes sub mento pragmatic diameter and that is 9.5 and if the head is less not very very fully extended the sub mento vertical diameter is also happen so almost 9.5 to 11.5 centimeter kind of diameter is there that's why vaginal delivery is possible but in mento posterior position which are of 20 to 25 percent of the cases there are less chances of there are less chances of delivery because the mento posterior in mento posterior cases the engaging diameter becomes much much higher that's why in that cases we should wait and watch and the vaginal delivery is not very expected in this mento posterior positions now another presentation mal presentation is of bro presentation what we were seeing in face presentation when the head is deflexed head is not flexed or not extended but it is deflexed at that time bro presentation happens that also called partial extension the engaged engaging diameter is actually very very high mento vertical diameter and that is 14 centimeter the highest diameter of the skull and that's why the delivery is not possible and we should go for cesarean section so very very easy thing you need to remember here very few things that the face presentation happens when there is a completely extension of head and bro presentation happens when there is partial extension of the head in men in face presentation mento anterior position is more common and vaginal delivery is possible but in mento posterior position in most of the cases it is not possible bro presentation happens by partial extension 
and the engaging diameter here is mento vertical that is 14 centimeter diameter delivery just cannot happen and you should go for a cesarean section thank you